Hey, what's up everyone? It's Liv Leader and welcome back to more Let's Play SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. Last time we went all the way from there to up here where King Jellyfish's nest is because Mr. Krabs was so nice enough to give us that information. We also got a few golden spatulas on the way from right there to right there to over there and then to right here where I'm standing. So, this time we will be going up to King Jellyfish and 1v1ing him. We're going to challenge him to a 1v1 and we're going to win. You know why? Because we are Spongebob and we're ready to get that Jellyfish Jelly for Squidward to rub all over himself. Alright? Let's go. Bubble Buddy! Gosh, everyone is trying to help out today. Step quietly there. That King Jellyfish is just up at the top of this path. Good luck. You'll need it. Thanks, Bubble Buddy. Alright, so, he says I will need it, and we don't need it because we're good. This gives us three underwears, which I don't see how is possible because we, you know, if we if we were missing three underwears, we'd be dead. So, you know, they're being generous and just, like, making fun of you because they're saying we need a king jelly. We need a lot of money. A lot of health. I love how he's singing the theme of this, um, of the jellyfish fields. The, you know, the song that plays in the background, the da 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 But anyway, um, it was in the outro of the second episode. So, anyway, this is... King Jellyfish. This is the King Jelly, the same King Jellyfish from, I believe, I'm your biggest fan fanatic. I believe that's what the name of the episode is. Um, if that, if I knew that from the top of my head, then I am a nerd. But anyway, this is the one. This is from that one episode with the thing and the stuff and the thing. But anyway, uh, this is King Jellyfish. All we have to do is dodge his attacks because you know we're too good at this and. Wait for it. Once he gets to the ground, we jump out of his reach and attack him. And there we go. One out of three hits. It's that easy. But anyway, let's just not say that. He's going to spawn a few jellyfish. I don't know where they come from. I don't want to know where they come from. But I'm just going to guess that he had him. He, he was um, eating them. And, you know, he let he, he just, you know, I don't know. I, I'm just going to stop. But anyway, let's get that box location because it's important. And let's just let him keep spawning his little babies. Um, you know, we don't care. They don't give us money, so we don't care about them. But anyway, here's his ultimate move. Ready for his ultimate move? Three. Oh, wait. Two. And three. That's his ultimate move. Ladies and gentlemen, that is King Jellyfish. All right. Come back later. Alright, I love that cutscene so much. It's just so random. He's just like, oh, well, I lost, so frick this place. I'm leaving. I love how he just moves away and then SpongeBob's just standing there waving around. Oh my gosh, I love that. I love that cutscene so much. For some reason, I don't know. I just love it. But anyway, let's uh, go over here. These are the peanut jars. You know, let's make fun of that. We unlocked this box for some reason. You want to know what that reason is? We're going to go and collect the other box. But... For now, we're going to end off. No, I was kidding. Okay, right, so let's jump down the slide for epic music again. And slide da 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 da. Okay, I'm gonna stop. But anyway, oh, and there we go. That's 100. Oh wait, no, that was probably like 75 um, shiny objects that we got. But you know, whatever. We're I don't know how to count. So let's just say that we got 75. And let's jump all the way here. Do that. Do this. Do this. Do this. I don't know what the point of um, having shtikis on this thing for because, you know, they disappear before you can actually destroy them, but, you know. And boom! There we go! There's another shiny or uh, golden spatula that we have. 
and that makes 10. We have double digits now. Yeah. High five, guys. High five. Boom. There we go. All right. So, let's check this, and all we need to do left is defeat King Jellyfish. King Jellyfish. So, that's what we did. So, and then we'll have all the golden spatulas in uh, Jellyfish Fields. All right. So, there we go. We unlocked that, so we can go back and ri ri ride that uh, slide again. These jellyfish are random. Ow. Ow. They're going to kill me, too. And um, they're just like the super king jellyfish offspring randomness. But um, Larry, so let's talk to Larry the Lobster, who is the best character in the SpongeBob universe. Universe, by the way. So let's go. See, no problem. You could do anything you set your mind and your muscle to. Inspirational quote of the day, folks. There you go. But anyway, let's go over here, and this is the exit. Use this springboard to go back to Jellyfish Rock. So let's go! And if you saw in the distance, you can see our houses. So I can see my house from here. All right, so now we're back at Jellyfish Rock, so let's go and talk to Squidward. Oh, yeah. Oh, that feels so much better. Anything for my best friend Squidward. Can I rub some on? Uh... What if I just gave you this? I love the airplane effect noise. <laughs> but anyway, let's get that. 11 golden spatulas. There's the chum bucket in the distance with some robots and tiki's looking at us. Look at them smiling for the camera. I hope that is the um, thumbnail of this video. So, anyway, that is it for Jellyfish Fields. We have not all of the socks. We'll return for the socks later. But for now, we have all of the important stuff, which is, which are the golden spatulas. I have good grammar, okay? Uh, so here we go. These are all of it. We got uh, 75, about 75% of Jellyfish Fields done. So next destination is Bikini Bottom. So we can go back to downtown Bikini Bottom. All right. So. Let's go back to Bikini Bottom, which is the hub world, and let's go. Call the taxi, and here we go. All right, so now that we're back in Bikini Bottom, we can now have we now have 11 golden spatulas, so we can unlock this taxi, which requires five. We can now go to Downtown Bikini Bottom, and we can also go all the way over here. Not quite enough to unlock the next area of Bikini Bottom, but just enough to go take the taxi to Goo Lagoon, which requires 10. But as much as I love Goo Lagoon, it's my favorite level of this whole game, we're going to skip out on that for now, and we're going to head on over to Downtown Bikini Bottom because that is our next destination according to the game's menu. So we're going to go to Downtown Bikini Bottom first. And then, after that, Goo Lagoon, my favorite map. But since this episode feels a little bit too short, oh, I believe it's like 20 minutes or so, so, you know, not that short, but the last thing we're going to do in this episode before we head off into downtown Bikini Bottom, we're going to check out Patrick's Rock, which we didn't on the first episode. We checked out SpongeBob's house and Squidward's house, but not Patrick's house. A little bit abusive if you ask me so let's go into Patrick's Rock where Patrick is in the yard and just lets us go in because we are best friends you know why we're best friends because look at that that is just beautiful but in here there are a few things we can do is destroy his couch and we'll find a sock hidden inside his couch which is nice we can also jump up here and get a few shiny objects and by a few I mean I think 10 we can play an amazing song I don't know why he has that and we can also get these that music is so overpowering, it's majestic. And we can destroy those, and we can get a few shiny objects and a sock in here. That will make us have 10 socks. So, if you know what that means, we can have 10 socks. We can go over here, and that's an even amount of money for me. So we can go and talk to Patrick. Oh, SpongeBob, you found some! Now they're back home, safe where they belong. Here's a golden back scratcher. Spatula. And we get 12 gold, uh, golden spatulas, not 12, we get 2. I don't speak Italian. Alright, so we get 2 golden spatulas for turning in 10 socks. So, we can also go right here, I believe. So, do you want to trade shiny objects for a golden spatula? Yes, we do. Quality craftsmanship, that is. 
And there we go. 13 golden spatulas. All right. So now that we have a few go uh, golden spatulas, we have a we have a few more side quests taken care of. Let's go down here, all the way down here, and Patrick. We have two ten socks for Patrick. There we go. We get we we only got one golden spatula. I don't know. I lost count. I guess I'm just too dumb. And we got one pat one um shiny object from Mr. Krabs. So next time we're gonna have to have three thousand five hundred, and this is still ten. It'll keep. It'll stay as ten forever. So. This time, or next time, we are going to take a taxi to downtown Bikini Bottom and see what's going on in here, because I hear some screaming, if, you know, you can hear it too. But, anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed, and next time we will take on downtown Bikini Bottom, alright? Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later.